Hey guys, what's up? It's Kay Jones coming at you with another video. This is going to be my three year Iron Man bank video slash really my skills and everything like that, my pets and my KCs. And I'm really excited to share it with y'all. Hope you enjoy. <music> Alright guys, so first I'm going to start with my stats, my quest points, and my achievement diaries. Okay, so first with my stats, I'm 2,242 total level. My account turned three years old a few days ago. I'm a little bit late because I had the flu and I had to postpone this video. I'm working on max right now. I'm not quite 99 and all skilled yet. My lowest level is 93 mining. It's almost 94, but I thought I would just go ahead and make this video. I tried to get it all 94 stats up, but it just didn't happen. I'm also 72k away from 99 hunter. So basically you could say that's 99 hunter. I'm just super duper close. Um, I'm also 214k till 98 fishing. I'm just really close to some levels. Uh, the longest skill for 99 was Slayer, obviously, and 94 Runecrafting took a very long time. Next is my quest. I have all of the quests done in RuneScape so far, and when a new one comes out, I just knock it out and get it done. So, looking really good. I do not have all the mini quests done. I'm missing three. I will eventually do them. I am just don't find them necessary at the moment. All right, the achievement diaries, I have them all completed. And that's that. And also the core in favor, I have all of that completed. So yeah, pretty sick. All right, so now we're gonna get to my bank. This has been over three years of making an Iron Man. So I'm so stoked. Let's go ahead and get to it. So my bank is worth, worth about 1.4 bill. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start with the boring tabs and move to the most exciting. But I'll go over this one first since it's just kind of like this general tab. Uh, 10 mil coins. I don't have that many coins right now, but it's not something I'm particularly concerned about. Um, I get coins when I need them, and I've already got 99 construction, which was the expensive cape. So our scales, I'm out, uh, which I'll have to get more. 1,355 marks of grace. That's just from been doing me doing agility. I'm sure I'll get a lot more going to 99. Some Tokyo, which is barely anything. Dark totems. Uh, I need to use those up for Skatizo, my Arc Light, Ancient Shards. This is actually really interesting because this is the order I got my skills capes on RuneScape. So my first 99 was fire making. Second was my quest cape, which I considered kind of a 99. Then a magic cape, HP was next, followed by thieving, ranging, achievement diaries, strength, defense, attack, farming, slayer, which is my favorite cape, uh, cooking, wood cutting, then construction. And the next 99 that will be in this slot, which I'm 70k till, is 99 hunter, which I probably should have knocked it out before this video, but it's whatever. I didn't want to procrastinate this video too long. I wanted to do it really close to the exactly three year mark on my Iron Man. This is all of my Elite Achievement Diary gear. It's pretty cool. My Void, Elite Void. I do not have the, oh no, I've got everything. Yeah, Elite Void. Uh, dark Tone Middle, I just needed to put it somewhere. My Full Graceful. I only have the Green Graceful because it's my favorite. Beginner, hard, medium, elite, and easy clue scroll. I haven't done it because, well, I don't really like clues. I think I have, oh gosh, a very small amount of clues done. It's pretty sad. All right, so I'm going to start with kind of the boring tabs now. So this is like kind of my costume slash fastenscape slash clues tab. Um, basically like my ice gloves, just miscellaneous stuff that, it's nice to have in my bank and I can't really put it in my house yet and it's just here it is like like the royal crown which is a pretty cool clue drop and things like that no third age I don't do clues enough and I don't like the rewards enough to really to really rock with them but I'm sure after max I'll get into them a lot more farming tab it's a mess 
I'm 99 farming. I really use this tab mostly for birdhouse runs. I have like barley seeds and hammerstone. Got a lot of snake dragons, toad flax. I have a 40 renars. I have a lot more seeds in the seed vault. This is barely anything. I won't be showing y'all my seed vault, but I probably have about 70 mil in seeds in my seed vault alone. And then in my bank, you know, this is just kind of the extras that I haven't decided to put in the vault. Um, and all the saplings and everything like that. I need to really clear out this. I don't need a lot of these saplings, but it's whatever. Next is like my Slayer slash Prayer tab. I'm already 99 Slayer, but I'm kind of uh, gathering in sold heads and stuff uh, for prayer still. And my bones, etc. I'm just kind of stacking them up here. Uh, so my Slayer gear and like blue dragon hide, just miscellaneous stuff, fossils. I think it looks nice. And here are my boots of brimstone, which is kind of cool. I don't ever need them because I have the elite uh, diary done for uh, Corrin. So I don't really need it, but still, that's kind of a rare drop and kind of neat. This is kind of a junky looking tab. Basically, it's a bunch of ranging, a bunch of ranging supplies uh, for bolts and arrows and a ton of darts. People are like, how do you have so many admin and mythical darts? It's because I made through all of them, made all of them through smithing and fletching, and they're good to have, especially admin and rune. I'm at 21,000 rune. I'll have to make, I've got, um, I can make a lot more later. Uh, my cannon, which I never really use, onyx bolt tips, which that alone is like 1.5 mil there. Uh, Ava's accumulator, I have my assembler and my main tab. 124 rune crossbows, I've always kind of collected these. So yeah, pretty cool. And here's some ballista limbs. I hopefully will finish the ballista one day. Next tab, this is like my tool tab. Uh, tool, jewelry, that's... Pretty much it. Nothing too excited. Just stuff for hunting and fishing and general skilling tools. Next is my ruin tab. Uh, there's nothing too crazy here. It's kind of ugly, but that's okay. Uh, bones to peaches, which are needed. I've got 254,000 blood runes. I've pretty much smithed, I mean not smith, rune crafted all of those. And I'll get a lot more going to 99 rune crafting. Uh, pure essence, most of those are from raids and Zora, of course. I know that pure essence is a really big thing Iron Man struggle for, with in the beginning. Battle staffs, not that many. I kind of stopped collecting them because I don't need the money anymore. But I'm sure I'll use those up for 99 crafting. Uh, my rune pouch, and that's pretty much it in this in this uh, tab. Next, we have my herb and food tab. I put them together because I feel like when you get food, you usually get... Um, usually get potions as well especially at this stage in the game for me uh this tab's actually kind of amazing in my opinion uh so i've got about a ton of super strength attacks and defenses about 762 ranging potions 465 super combats i could make a ton more i just haven't in fact i could make about 367 more 1200 ish brews uh, a lot of prayer potions, which I'm actually kind of low. I've got another 282 unfinished ones down below. And let's see, I've got, I think, Renards somewhere. 232 Renards. So I've got plenty of that. Uh, super Restores, I'm low on those, but I can make plenty. 1,000 Staminas, I could make a lot more of those too. It's just not really needed. 1,000 Anti-Fires, just basically all set. 2,000 Files of Blood from T.O.B., uh, and food. That's about 12,000 monkfish that I fished in the past. Uh, wines. Um, yeah, and 1,500 bird's nests. It was pretty impressive. I've been doing bird's nests to 99 uh, Hunter. I did uh, a lot of ch uh, catching chins for armadillos, so that got me a ton of uh, hunter levels. I mean, yeah. Whenever I got chins for armadillo, it got me a ton of hunter levels. Uh, and then I have my angler outfit. I have it in here because all my fish, is, fish are in here. Almost 99 fishing, so I'll probably put that in the bank eventually. So, and check it out. Just unfinished potions that I'll eventually use. I've got a lot of certain, like, toad flax and just some uh, herbs here. I'm 97 herb lore, but honestly, I have 99 banked. I just need to do it. 
and I've been focusing on other skills right now. I'm not too worried about that skill because I know I have it banked and that I just need to do it. Okay, next tab is going to be the first tab. I skipped the second one because the second one's like my wow tab, which is like all my armor and gear. I love this tab. I think it looks great. Um, I know a lot of people have a lot of questions. They're like, how do you have so many freaking gems? Uh, collecting over time, I would have a lot more dragon stones, but I, I donated a bunch to skilling con competitions for my clan. So I dropped a bunch of dragon stones from like the crystal keys over um, for my clan and stuff like that. So we would have money for skilling competitions. Two onyxes, I got those from Zora. Dragon pickaxe, which is pretty big. Uh, 111k coal, a lot of that's mined, a lot of that's from miscellanea, because now that I have 99 construction, I don't really need planks from miscellanea, I can just get coal from it. Uh, a bunch of ore, uh, that I'll have to eventually smelt, this is just from getting 94 mining, I think from 93 to 94, not even 94 yet, but it's already a nice collection building up. 607 gold nug nuggets. Uh, because I already have full prospector, the upstairs unlocked, and the big bag. So I think that would be cool in my progression video to buy like a ton of gem bags and open them up. That would be exciting. Uh, just some bars. Uh, 73k maple logs. I won't ever do anything with this. I just did that to get bird's nest uh, through miscellanea. Some redwoods. Uh, two dragon axes. One's an infernal axe. I don't know why I made that infernal axe. It was kind of dumb. Uh, planks, which I'll never use because I'm 99 construction, but who knows? One day, maybe I'll try to get more XP. One Pharaoh Scepter. I don't have more than one. Uh, 27,000 buckets of sand. Kind of crazy. 37 glories. I would have more glories if I turned these dragon stones into them, but I don't find the reason to. And honestly, I probably should just go ahead and get rid of all this extra, like, jewelry in my bank. But it looks cool, and eventually I'll alk it, so... But I have everything in my house I could ever need to teleport around RuneScape, so I don't necessarily need uh, these these rings and stuff. But it looks cool in my crafting tab. Finally, for the main tab that we all love, boom, boom, boom. So from my two my previous progression videos, I had a lot of stuff stacked. So from my one year progression video and my two year progression video, I had a lot of rune items stacked. I act out all those for 99 construction um and i like to kind of hold alcables um and i will build my collection again because i'm doing a lot of post 99 slayer after i've maxed it's a goal my red slayer helmet which is my most adored probably item in my bank i don't know why i love the red slayer helmet it is awesome and it, i wear the red slayer helmet even when raiding which makes no sense because it's not even the best in slot helmet for rating. I just love it. 17 dragon boots. I don't know why I have so many. I guess when I was going killing spiritual mages and stuff like that, I got them. A couple dragon two hands, dragon plate legs. I don't have a dragon uh, chain body, which is actually kind of interesting. Scrolling down, you see my dragon warhammer, my abyssal bludgeon. I really only use my bludgeon for calflight queen and cerberus, uh, but it's a good weapon. I actually like the abyssal dagger more. But I ended up getting the bludgeon, so that's all right. Tentacle whip, five extra whips. My Avernic Defender. This is my only drop I've gotten from TOB. I'm like 170k or 170kc for um, Theater Blood, and that's the only drop I have. But I absolutely love the Defender. It's the drop I wanted the most. So, hey, I'm happy I got it. We got the Serpentine Helm. Um... Three god swords. I don't have the Zamorak god sword. Here's my Zamorak in Hosta. I will eventually go back and get that. I just don't find it necessary. I just eventually will get it. We've got Amulet of Torture, Ring of Suffering, Anguish, Fury. I don't have the um, bracelet for Mage. I need to go back and get the Zenite for that. Two Dragonfire Shields. I just got really lucky and got two. Um... Here's some God's sword, sword, bleh, God sword shards. We've got salve amulets. We've got Hydra Eye, Hydra Fang. I'm missing the third piece for Hydra to make 
that ring that's like a good overall ring. It would go in this slot once I get it though. Uh, Barrow's gear. I do not have all the Barrow's gear. I got most of the important Barrow's gear. So like full Derek. I don't have a Guthin's helm, which sucks, but I'll go get it one day. Uh, Aram's. And I don't really need Guthin's though because I have a Ceridome and Godsword. Varric and all that good stuff. Last year you didn't see me. I did not have full Armadil. I do have it this year, so that was super exciting. I didn't have the skirt, I think. So this skirt took me 1,090 Armadil kills or Kriara kills. It was awful. Like, oh my gosh, this is such a valued item in my bank. It's ridiculous. So coming down here, I've got the Dragon Hunter crossbow, which I got from Raids 1. Uh, that was pretty sick, and it's really useful. Twisted Buckler, I've got the Armadil crossbow, and I don't know, I just put some dark bows there, because why not? I've got Ancestral Top and Bottom. I don't have the hat, which is okay with me. Code I Wand, that is my only mega rare I've ever gotten from Raids. Uh, hoping to get a Twisted Bow one day. Maybe my four-year bank, uh, four bank video I'll have it, who knows? Eternal, Primordial, and Pecasian Boots. Bandos, I have two Bandos chest plates. Uh, Black Mask, there's that Assembler and my Blowpipe, and the Uncharged Tridents and the Tridents. So, yeah, this is like the sexy tab, you know? But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I guess what we can now go into is perhaps some KC. Um, was it the Ring of Wealth? I'll also show you all my pets. So let's look at the boss log. So there's Kriara, 1,090 KC. Uh, so that took a long time to get the Armadillo items I wanted. Com Commander Ziliana is 109. Definitely the luckiest freaking boss would be probably Ceridoman. I got the Armadillo crossbow and freaking, what's it called? hilt in 109 KC, which is insane. General Gardor, 113, ridiculously lucky. You got the hilt, two bandage chest plates, and tacits in 113 KC. Uh, 142 for Zami. I got pretty lucky at God Wars, I will say, other than Kriara. Coming down here, King Black Dragon, 537. I'm just kind of looking for some of the good Barrow's chest, 500. I stopped flat on 500. Zora, 1,182 KC. Uh, Kraken's over 1,000. Chambers of Zarek, which is Raids 1, 663 KC. Pretty good. Uh, hoping to get a ton more of that after I've maxed. So that's 663. Uh, no challenge mode. I plan to do that after I get a Tebow. Uh, Vorkath, 309. Theater of Blood, 167 KC. Hydra 160. I haven't done much Hydra because um, I hit 99 Slayer and I just didn't really find a reason to go back. So let's go ahead and go to my show y'all which pets I have because honestly it's been a while. So let's go to my uh, construction house. I don't know why. And my house is built, built in a way that everything I could ever need is like prayer, altar here, pool rejuvenation pool and ornate jewelry box all set it's not fancy but it has everything i could ever need right here spirit tree all within a really good click radius so my favorite pet that i have is the king black dragon i've always wanted it since i was little and i got super lucky and i got it and that was like it's my favorite pet and it will probably always be my favorite bossing pet my favorite skilling pet is the heron and i don't have it in one day hopefully the Rock Golem, uh, this was my first pet ever on RuneScape, ever, 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 the Rock Golem, and I love it. The green is my favorite. I have the Hell Puppy from Cerberus. Uh, it's not my favorite, but it's a great pet. And then I have the Rift Guardian. I think I have every pet in here except the Rock. But yeah, I have a great selection of pets. I have one, two, three, four unique ones, and I love them. And then there's my Hellcat, of course. Um... But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And feel free to subscribe to my channel for my future videos. I do Iron Women progression videos. So 
every, I have, I think I have like 40 plus episodes on my channel, on a playlist on my channel if you want to check it out. And uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all next time, hopefully. Bye, guys.